It's kind of easy. Really? Yeah. There's not really any walls to get caught on, so... That works. Then again, if you get surrounded, you're like absolutely screwed, but... I'm gonna go Commando, I guess. See, I want this fucking DLC pack now. Just for the Tommy gun. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah, I love Tommy guns. Derp, 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 derp. It's nighttime. I wish it was daytime. Jesus, mind that fucking right play. All right, dude, just kill everything. That works. Nah, I didn't want any kills. I at least get to kill my own fucking mom. Okay. All right. The fuck, we going. Why is everybody faster than me? Why is a right, bitch ton of shit for fucking wave one? Everybody moves at their own pace, you know. No, I don't know. Nobody's ever loved me. Or taught me anything in life. Except how to be a hoe on Vine Street. Teaching you the ABCs of friendship and love. And tricking on the streets. That's how I, I got to where I am in life. Uh, fucking dead cows. They're gonna be McDonald's one day, yay. Uh, shit, I wanna keep that freaking zombie time going. I get some sweet ass headshots that way. Oh, yeah. You know, I would agree with you if I actually got to kill something this round. I'm getting some decent kills just standing out here in this corn. You guys are like fucking crackheads. You run around at like Superman speed and shooting everything. Mm. Then I get over there like, where's the party, guys? And you guys are gone. We just snoop dogged it and left. Exactly. Snoop lion. Uh, you know if you freaking go into Google and type in snoop dog, it autocorrects the snoop lion. No, I didn't, but... Yeah, I tried that the other day. He's a brother in dread. Respect him. I really thought that was a joke. I didn't think he was serious at first. Yeah, no, I, th I thought it was too. And then I heard it, and then I thought it was a joke too. Mm. Nope. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, like, you guys are joking. He wouldn't really do that. Nah, he doesn't have, like, millions of songs attached to his old name, and nobody knows what Snoop Lion is. Yeah, right. Like, here's Snoop Lion, and you're like, uh, alright. Like, is this, like, some type of parody of Snoop Dogg, or... I don't know. He's trying to be hard. <laughs> I'm like, maybe, just, just maybe he smoked one too many blunts. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, he's still cool, but, you know, not really cool. <laughs> Alright. I have the futuristic shotgun once again. And this time, instead of trying to kill monsters, I'm going to go back to my original goal of fucking bitches and getting money. And I think I'll win. Why is everybody in the slaughtered barn thing? Why not? Uh, because it has AIDS. Oof. And that shit is contagious. Should go ahead and close this door in that case? You know, everybody, everybody's going to die in there. Uh, I was going to weld you guys in. See now, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I got like no ammo. I got like six clips for this M4, and then I got no ammo from a pistol. So, uh, you want ten bucks? Oof! If only the shop was still open. <laughs> I'm sure it is. It's just knock really loud. She might just let you slam the door. Maybe if you like, you offer to eat her out or something. She might let Maybe. you in. It's kind of ugly though, I wouldn't do it. When I look at her, I get the feeling it smells like fish down there, so... You know. And thus, I would assume it tastes like ass down there, so... Unless that's all just an elaborate ruse and it just tastes like candy corn and... Heaven. Her pussy tastes like vanilla. Tasty, huh? 
No, I'm not saying she's a gold digger. I want to hear that now. Thank you. No problem. I do what I can. But you know, copyright and shit, so I can't play it. Too Kanye, I love Kanye. <laughs> I'm just gonna shut up now. You know, it's kind of gross when you watch somebody kind of just explode their insides everywhere. I thought you were just gonna say it's kind of gross to watch Kanye West do anything. I was, oh no. I was gonna half agree with you. It's kind of cool and kind of awkward to watch him do shit. Yeah. Like, I like him, but he kind of just sometimes. It's kind of a. You know, he kind of not... sets himself up for like bad times. Yeah. To put it politely. He makes good music though, but you know, sometimes he gets a little too full of himself. Good way to put it. Good way to put it. You know, sometimes he might just you know take the microphone from people. I mean, like sometimes dogs are brown, but. No, sometimes they're not. Some, sometimes you touch the sky. Sometimes Phenom's mom made me blow myself up. I wasn't my mom, it was my aunt. So, don't disrespect. K thanks. I don't appreciate you talking about my mom like that. Because I wasn't my mom, it was my aunt. So, you know. I wholeheartedly apologize. I'm just going to look at these. I fucking hate this map, I'm just gonna say that now. Yeah, I feel ya. It's boring, cause like, there's no real threat of dying unless you don't care like I'm doing right now. Mm -hmm. Alright, time to heal myself and like, run 20 fucking country miles to the traitor. Oh, there's a screaming bitch over there though, so... I'm gonna walk around her. Like, they really shouldn't have called this farm. They should have just called this fucking Bufu Egypt, and it would have made more <laughs> sense. Because this, this shit is just like, okay, Trader was over here, and now she's over there. Yeah, I always wondered, like, how she just packs up shop and kind of sneaks away. Like, and I like how we never, yeah, we never see the bitch leave the building she was just in. She just shuts the door, and then she's like, up, oh, I'm in Colorado now. <laughs> then the doors open back up, and she's in fucking Paris. Oh, I'm Fucking going gorillas. I don't even know what that means. One day. No one knows what it means. The it's phenom dictionary. Gets the people going. Plus 10 to hype. You can't fucking ring the bell, that's cool. It's time to go shopping. There's always gotta be one hype man in the group. That would be probably no. Nah, I can't be Robbie. He's too boring. Someone's, Someone's just gotta, gotta stand there and be like, "Oh!" <laughs> is that is that what a hype man does? Yeah, dude. Someone I never like, knew that. Someone just throws down something really good to some made-up beat in their head, and then their friend in the background's like, "Oh shit!" <laughs> I'm just like, oh, "Okay," because like, like I didn't know a hype man just did the the bitch scream. Pretty much just like Chris Tucker in any situation ever. Yeah, pretty much. like hype man. The, that that analogy right there just put it all on point. I get you now. Those are also yeah. known as instigators, though. True. You know, both. I just need a personal hype man to like follow me around everywhere. Oh, it'd be cool. Just like going to work, tell off your boss. He's like, oh shit. Right, but that would get you into a lot of trouble because even if you weren't being like a dickhead, you would sound like a dickhead. That's true. Like you're a really good boss. Uh, like that that would just sound like you're being sarcastic <laughs> like it's like are you back talking me no i'm not doing that why would i do that like that would everything would be taken sarcastic though when followed by the aw oh, shit so. yeah that's true i mean you can make it like nicer have it be like i don't know like you can't really make quiet, it nicer you a really just quiet you polite aw oh, shit you can be talking to like one of your girls and just be like no that doesn't make you look fat and then when he does it you don't get any pussy tonight, so <laughs> I don't think that's a good idea. It'd be funny though, but not funny when you're like jacking off for the night because she said no. Oh god, I'm gonna die. I 
I got my sweet little. They don't like my kind around there, so I ran off. I got my little bull pup. Is it is it working out for you? No. Thanks for that. Yeah, I so thought like I'm surprised you were like happy about the bull pup. I was a little happy to like have a gun with ammo and stuff, but <laughs> I got a gun. There's really much else to say about it. It's like uh it shoots. It's like when you go to see a movie and the only like good quote on the front is just that it says it's a movie. Right. Or like two thumbs. Like not up, <laughs> not down, just two thumbs. I like how they, they do that for video games. Like all yeah, the time. <laughs> it's like it's a game. <laughs> you play it with a controller. IGN. <laughs> right. It's like one of the strangest things I've played. <laughs> <laughs> I could go either way. Or it's like the quote's all chopped up, so it's like I with some periods, and then it says love with some periods, and then it says this game. <laughs> I love those reviews. I do too. Because it could be it could be something totally different. Just it could say like I fucking hate this game, it sucks ass. What I do love is this game, but then they could just <laughs> chop it up like that. Like we're joking about it, but that seriously happens a lot. Oh yeah. Like a whole lot. And it's always IGN too. Yeah, I know. Usually though, if you're quoting an IGN thing, it's probably not a good review. Like IGN, they rarely rate games high that aren't like, you know, things they have to choke on because of sponsorship. I mean, I'm not going to say like more money than skills, but if IGN was a rapper, it'd be like more money than skills. <laughs> it's like, like if it's Call of Duty or something, it'll probably get a good rating. Yeah. Freaking PC Gamer actually had the balls, which just made me really happy. They actually had the balls to like give Black Ops like a 5 out of 10, which just made me smile so much. And see, that makes me sad, because if any Call of Duty was going to get a decent score, I would have gave it to Black Ops. I mean, I thought it was alright. I've played, I've played all of them, not like a Call of Duty fan in any way, but I've played all of them, just because like, you kind of have to. Like, yeah. You'll play them at some point, even if you don't like them. But, and if you don't play them, you just wake up one day and you'll be playing it like, what the fuck am I doing? Yeah, exactly. You wake up, you get drugged, and you're just playing it out of nowhere. Bunch of guys in suit from Activision, like, you have to play this game. Everybody has to play this game. Yeah, hi, we have in our records. You haven't uh, purchased Call of Duty again this year. Uh, how about you come outside with us? <laughs> yeah. Went ahead and took the money out of your bank account and bought it for you. <laughs> I think that's how it sells so much, honestly. Probably, it's just the money actually like flies out of your wallet and just goes straight to them. Because if you look at YouTube, nobody should be buying Call of Duty because everybody hates it. Yeah, I know, it's kind of funny. But every Call of Duty game sold more games than any game before, and then next year sold more games than any Oh, I like, love that. It's like, okay, cool. That's what we're going to do now? Cool. Also, I have $1,100, so Damn. here's hoping I don't die. Uh, apparently I just switched my class to support specialist, and I did not mean to do that. Uh, can you switch back, or are you screwed? Nope, I am 110% fushigied. Well, just, uh, bend over and close your eyes and go to your happy place. Also, I'm gonna go ahead and just go to Kentucky now, because I'm sure she's gonna be over here somewhere. Good call. Ooh. Some magnums and a shotgun, I can do that. Wait, why didn't, why didn't they get purchased? <laughs> Dude, you got eight seconds. I have like, I have the exact amount of money I need to purchase them. Three, three uh -huh. seconds. All right, we're good, we're good. Uh, me and Ghost are like over here by this, this fence. And nobody else is. Also, there's a sign that says like, welcome to rape. So if uh, you guys could show up, that'd be great. If not, then uh, I'll see you later. On my way. I don't really know what fence you're by, but I'm coming. There's like nothing here but like a truck, a cow, and a fence, so find me. Uh, that, I don't know. That's a little too descriptive. It's like this whole map is just one truck, one cow, and one fence. And a tree in the background you can never actually get to. Pretty much, yeah. Oh no, Ghost is leaving me. Why are you so fast? Oh god. Hey, that was look, that looked like a regular. Oh no, he had the hillbilly shit. All right, never mind. Thought it was a regular guy, but he wasn't. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm so dead. I got, I got, I got. 
I'm just like using all the focus I got to try and wrap my head around the shotgun. Oh, I definitely thought you were like jacking off. I mean, I can try and wrap my head, but I don't really know. I'm just like, he got really quiet. It must be personal. I'm just gonna not interrupt that. Done. Like a picture of Nicki Minaj just popped up on your screen. He's like, whoop, time to jack off. You like turn on super bass and look at a picture of Nicki Minaj and just jack it. It's about that time again, isn't it? Yep. Hey, I found Ghost. I can't find anybody. I mean, except like the three people around me, but they don't count. <laughs> I can't find anybody. Why don't they count, Tote? It's because they're white? Uh, Are you being racist? A little. I don't, I don't tolerate racism, Tokyo. You I mean, leave white people alone. Okay. I'm trying, dude. I got it's the like, moon. I just Shit. noticed, like, you say you're mixed with stuff, right? Yeah. So apparently we're building some type of, like, mixed militia or something like that. Oh, why? What's Robbie? Everything. Like, everything. Oh, cool. <laughs> yeah. Like, I think it's impossible for him to, like, find something he's not mixed with. It's baller. Although he doesn't really look like he's mixed with a bunch of stuff, he just looks like he's black and white or something. Yeah. And he also looks like a football player because he's like really huge. I'm pretty sure he has like some of everything. Word. Like you don't have any German in you. He's like, yes I do. My uncle's name was like Schnitzelwugen. <laughs> and he married an American Indian. Who gave birth to a Japanese kid somehow? Who gave birth to a dude named Haytham? Who fucked another Indian and made a kid named Connor? And then somehow a tree got involved, and now there are tree people. I have not got that far in Assassin's Creed. I did not know Connor made a tree person. Spoiler alert. I'm I'm really sad now. I was really just gonna play through that whole game, but now that I know at the end of it, he fucking kills all the Templars and make the fucking tree baby. I don't need to play anymore. Thanks, Tokyo. No problem. I'll save you the next uh, three hours of running around doing nothing. But killing wolves and jumping through trees? I still haven't played it, and I mean, I probably will, but... Just fucking watch a Let's Play, man. Yeah. I haven't I played, played Assassin's Creed since the first one. Oh, well then you need to play an Assassin's Creed badly. Have they gotten, like, actually better? I yeah, mean, the first one was good at the time. And now it's ass horrible. Really? Yeah. Oh god, he started reloading instead of shooting. I just I remember know. it being way too fucking repetitive. Yeah, like, but at the time it was kind of cool. Cause it was like, what? I'm like killing people in ways I've never killed people in a video game. And yeah. Then, like, a year later it was like, this is boring as shit. Like, I just did the same thing ten times, and then the game was over. But, uh, yeah, they're really good now. Word. I'm gonna have to check them out. I think if you, if you like, gonna play through all of them, and you really want the story, I was, st now, I wouldn't even suggest buying the first one. Just watch a Let's Play. Yeah. Because it was kind of that boring. Well, I mean, I played through it. Back you in beat the it day. all the way? Yeah, when it first came out. And then two, I haven't even, I've never even touched it. Yeah, they're, they're actually worth playing. Oh, I didn't even realize I was like right in front of you. I didn't even know that was you. I should have noticed the fucking Nazi uniform, but I didn't. Probably. Yo, this map is mad boring. I'm like, hella bored. Yeah. Well, hey, maybe we'll be actually like, be able to beat it. I'm fine <laughs> with that. I just now noticed we had the last round. I'm just like daydreaming. Ooh, well, yeah. I have I money now. Yeah, 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 yeah like how many? 1500. I have like 2400. Alright, let's change my perk back to commando. Yeah, commando. It's official. I'm definitely fucking bitches and getting money this time. Sip a pop. I want some so bad. I mean, I could spit it at the computer screen and hope it gets to you, but. Dude, maybe. 
I'm not know. sure if it works like that. Go for it. Well, I mean, I what's try, worst that's gonna happen? Maybe my computer breaks. Not sure. Maybe. Oh, right, I got an AA12. Final... We can't lose. All right. Uh, I'm just gonna stock up on ammo and body armors and shit. Do you have enough to do shit, and do you want my other shotgun? No, I'm I'm good. I'm good. I got this uh, FAO with an ACOG on it. I didn't know they made the Patriarch dude uh, Chuck Norris. Apparently. Or Walker, Texas Ranger, or whatever. Also, that's a fuck ton of pipe bombs. Yeah, I think we're all set. If we just I'm not gonna here. stand there. I'm gonna just weld this other door just in case he wants to come this way. Because if you haven't noticed, he's a bit of a troll. Alright. So I'm pretty sure he's gonna come the other way just because all the bombs are over here, but. Yeah. I think we'll be okay. Pretty sky out tonight. So, uh. You come into this barn often? Uh, occasionally. No. Like, try and pick up chicks, but. There's only Ow. dudes here, so. And bombs. Plenty of bombs. Where the hell is he? I don't know, but listen, you want to get out of here and maybe go back to my place? Yeah, why not? Is it this little uh, shack over here? I mean, maybe we should probably wait for the zombie apocalypse to be over, but uh, yeah, afterwards, yeah, it's definitely that shack right there. Sounds good, sounds good. Or, you know that tree anywhere, honestly. I'll just hang out on this cow for now. True. Uh, is he glitched somewhere, though? Because... He might be. This is, I mean, he does move kind of slow, doesn't he? Uh, I hear him talking, so... And no, he kind of teleports and shit wherever he wants to be. The hell is he? Uh, everybody's shooting behind me, so... Oh, he, he came in the wrong door, didn't he? Probably. Why did you weld the barn... Dude, you welded the barn doors. <laughs> I don't know. I watched you do it. <laughs> I hope this guy's just one of those people that, like, he does something that just blames it on everybody else. Oh, God. Uh, well, I found the guy. Oh, you did? Yeah, he's, he's coming around, but I'm, like, typing, oh, shit. Shit, fuck. Enter and run. Oh, I accidentally uh... hit type, and then, uh, <laughs> I got stuck. So I couldn't move. And I'm not gonna stand on the pipe bombs before he shoots a fucking dick missile at me and kills me. Also, swag master something something. This is a swag master Naru. I couldn't read the rest of it before he fucking disappeared. And somebody unwelded the other door, so that's cool. That works. And I hear Triple H, so he's somewhere nearby. Oh, there he goes. Oh, you found him? Yeah, he's like fucking punching me in the face. Fuck you! Fuck you! Ooh, no good. Well, I used the whole clip of AA-12 on him, and that's sitting over there if you want it, so there's that. Alright. If I can uh, figure out where the hell, you know, he died. Oh, wait. Uh, buy that patch of grass. I think we're all set. I think we just detonated all the pipe bombs on him. Yeah, you guys got it. Where the hell is he? Oh, is that your little ghost? You can see my ghost now? Yeah. Yeah, something's up with this fucking server. Oh, I just killed it. You killed the Patriarch? No, I killed your ghost. Oh. Ouch. Couldn't let me live in peace, could you? Nope. Oh shit, I hear it. I mean, we met at the barn, and we talked about going to the shack, and I thought we had something special, but, uh... You just dance on my grave. Thanks, change, man. Also, there's a crawler killing ghost. Should probably help him. I feel like I'm gonna be the next to die. Yeah, cause you're like all by yourself. The fuck are you do, doing? Man. I don't know, dude. I thought I'm I was like, like the dumbass chick in the scary movie that runs by herself in lingerie and falls. Where the fuck were you going? 
don't know. I thought like there were some people back there that I could help or something. <laughs> Special Agent Frank West on the case. It's like everybody's just up here like, you know, let's stick together. And you're walking behind the barn like, I'm just going to take a piss over here. <laughs> Nothing bad will happen. It's not like oh, I'm looking shit. for He's a monster. Back to the barn. Wow, he's going to fucking kill you guys. Not today. Uh, well, he just killed Baz, but then you guys killed him, so. I hid behind this plank of wood, and I survived. Me and Baz died. Oof. That was good. Uh, I can't throw money. Wow. I don't even know how to throw money. Uh, <laughs> it's B. Oh, it's B? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay, not Manor again, even though it's a good-ass stage. Fucking, aw, they didn't let me disconnect. Brutal. All right. I'm out of that lobby. Yeah, I'm actually gonna. I need I'm, to go make some food. I'm yeah, I'm done with killing floor. Yeah. That's a fucking hour long worth of. Wow. Well, alright. Next time we see you guys, we'll be playing other shits and having more fun because that lobby was kind of bleh. So, Sounds yeah. Like... Say, Say ya. bye. Say bye, Tokyo. Say ya. That's how he says bye, apparently. Have a good ass day. All right.